Districts would be required to pay to install these cameras in all of their classrooms, but teachers say there is a much better use of their already depleting general funds. The inappropriateness of believing that there should be continual videotaping of a classroom is something that should not even be considered. Educators are expressing concern over a controversial bill at the state house. The measure calls for cameras to be placed in all Iowa classrooms. That way parents can see what's going on at their child's school. I think it helps continue the parental involvement that has occurred due to COVID. Republican State Representative Norlin Momsen authored the bill. Some educators fear the cost to install these cameras into classrooms could be pricey. The bill outlines the school would foot the bill to pay for the new technology. Our funding stream is shrinking. We are being asked to take more out of that instead of finding more to serve the students that we have. But Momsen argues schools could use equipment they already have. I will respectfully disagree with them because we already have a system through, you know, through COVID. He says using the cameras on teachers' laptops would be the most cost-effective way to roll out this plan. Those laptops would be set in the back of the class so the privacy of students can be protected. But the Iowa State Education Association argues this practice could be too invasive for students and teachers. There are federal laws that this bill violates in terms of privacy and the work that our students do in our classrooms. That's right. If the bill becomes law, educators could potentially face fines for not complying. It would also require districts to re restrict access to live streams to only parents or guardians of the students. Stacey?